What's up, guys? I must sell this hole in my roof. <sighs> now I need to fix that again. Well, guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to tame an Orchitina. I think that's how you pronounce it, Orchitina. Um, or we're we gonna call it a Tina little shells those little snails um oh my soul i'm not gonna get out of here oh okay i am okay so what do we need to tame one of those little thingamajigs we are gonna need <clears throat> sweet vegetable cake guys if you don't know how to make it Please go check out my other videos on how to make it. You're always gonna have you're also gonna have to go check out my videos on how to get tree sap, stimulant, and honey. They are all there guys. I'm not gonna explain that again because it's quite a lot of stuff. So let's go get something so our, our trunks and our gun I wonder where is my gun uh, uh, I think I put it somewhere here and some trunks maybe it's in here so I'm not gonna use um, trank arrows I'm gonna use trank dogs because it's just easier oh my soul where did I put it I need to organize these things now we don't need that much tranks guys because oosh, that's quite a bit I forgot my gun with me oh nice nice that's awesome okay so I'm gonna take some toxins with me guys a lot of people use um narcotics to keep animals asleep i just take biotoxins it's cheaper and it's easier and then we are gonna need some sweet vegetable cake open up sesame But five yeah let's take some more because we will we'll have to go and look for one of those little shit holes okay I'm gonna change my view guys because I'm actually used to playing like this so let's take our little taper jar do you have some meat in you my friend oh you still have a lot of metal on you Hmm. I don't want to drive you around with a lot of meat or... let's get some meat just gonna steal some meat real quick real real quick because I'm too lazy to go and get it so I'm gonna take another bird I'm gonna leave you here and unpack yourself all right we need to work together on this space. And don't, why are you always pooping when I'm speaking to you? Right, I'm gonna get you guys a new friend. Let's go. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're a little bit glitchy today again. That's nothing new. So a Bronta actually destroyed this whole catwalk. And I had to build it again. But I'm still busy, yeah. So oh, we're gonna we're not gonna get past you. Let's just sneak past you guys. <laughs> and there's the purple type of Dejara that I colored. I was actually hoping his wings would turn purple, but oh well. Okay, let's rock and roll. We're gonna go get some of those little hard shells. 
Okay, so let's see if we can find some of those little guys. I saw a few of them here. I actually just hate the woods because there's a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Of terror birds. Oh, here's a type of jara. For you guys that's wondering where you can find a type of jara. I've been finding type of jaras here quite a bit. Let's just look at the coordinates. It's 62.7, latitude, longitude 43.5, around about there, guys. It's not going to be exactly there all the time. It's probably going to die now, but that's life in arc. I would normally go and save that little one. But then he would get aggressive on me probably and just, well, Tapajoros usually don't get aggressive. But I'm not here. What's this? Ooh. You're far away from her. Okay guys, where's Horchals? Let's have a look. I'll fly where I usually see. Or shells. Uh, let's see. There's usually some here, but it can also get a little bit dangerous. Here. Also get a little bit dangerous. Any pl tree platform here, yeah. so that we can just chill and have a look. Guess I'm flying too high to really see them, but usually I've got good eyes. I've got good eyes. Usually I do see them. But if there's a lot of terror birds, then you're not going to really find them. Because the terror birds kill. Freaking, here's a hot shell. Here's a hot shell. Well, there's a few terror birds here. So let's just pop this guy here. Yeah? Just pop this little guy here. Yeah? Oh, there's one just here. Okay, well, let's, let's do it. Let's do it, yeah. Safest place. Okay, guys, you need to shoot it in each shot. Boop. Out like, oh, not out like a baby. Out like a baby now. Alright, and then we're going to put in some sweet vegetable cake. That's the only thing you can tame these guys for. So let's put it in there. Right. And we're gonna wait. Oh my soul. Oh and the toxins. Put the toxins in there. And we're gonna see what's gonna happen. So I'm gonna feed him one toxin. Feed Whoa! I guess that's a little bit too strong for him. What do you want to die? I don't think so. <laughs> Let's hope so. He doesn't die. It should time fast, guys, because it is on the best thing I can make. And that's sweet vegetable cake. Let's guess 25. 20. Hello? Zero? Zero. Come on. 33. Alright, that's alright. That's not too bad. So let's just give you some more of this toxins. Whoop, whoop, whoop. You're sleeping like a baby. Oh, 
Okay, so let's just wait for it. Oh my soul. It's gonna take forever. Well, not really. Uh, yeah, guys, and that's basically how you tame the Arcatina. Sometimes it will say put food into your inventory to tame, just remove everything, and then you just put it back in. Because uh, I don't know why it does that, maybe it's glitchy, and then it will start tameing again. So just do that, that shouldn't be a problem. And yeah, let's hope this one tames. We won't be able to take it back with our tapered jar though, but I'll show you a little trick on how to transfer this little guy back to base without any trouble. Oh my soul, and I'll get back to you guys when it's almost done. Okay guys, well it's almost done and we almost have our first... It's a hard shell. We almost have our hard shell. And then we are going to transport it back to base because you know what? It is very difficult to get an animal that's not very strong back to your base when you're in a dangerous area. So whether it's a small animal or big animal just you know just request it that's it take everything out of its inventory and request it and it will respawn at your nearest bed from that specific location but you need to remember if you go into its inventory after you, you requested it the request will be cancelled. So take everything out of his inventory. Alright. Then you go to your inventory. Just don't look at the, the animal. Go into your inventory. Go to your stats. You'll see these times. Press on that. And then you are going to request that specific animal. Sometimes you'll get disconnected from a server and fall from your bird and you won't be able to um, ask it to follow you. Just request it and as you can see it will say all items in the creature will be lost. So make sure there's nothing in its inventory that you're going to lose. Don't go back to that animal after you request it. Just get on your bird or whatever and go back to the base or continue with what you're doing. If your base is safe, it will respawn to the closest bed. I don't think it works with the sleeping gap back though, guys. So when we get back to base, guys, our little creature will be at the base. And well, that's it from me, guys. Crowned Leech, please remember to watch my videos and subscribe. Okay, bye bye.